Yeah, I'm always going to get three uh, replays for a set. So, game number two looks like Pass has chosen match point. All right, in the bottom left is the blue Protoss, we do have Choosy, for Team Poland. And in the top right is the Teal Zerg, Mr. Pass. He's probably not using Mini. That's fine. Uh, it looks like they actually switched colors this time. Um, they switched positions as well, so Choosy, or Pass rather. Um, yeah, good. Oh wait, no. Wait, no. Okay. Alright. So, Juicy sending out the pro, probably just gonna pile on up the front. And uh, obviously, being a two player map, the overlord's going in the right direction. Good stuff, good stuff. Now, um. Last game, actually, I think Choosy, yeah, Choosy scouted pass first, so his 9 pull speed was, you know, immediately scouted and couldn't really do any damage. Uh, and in this case, obviously, being a two-player map, it seems that, yeah, pass is not going to go for it. He's building an Overlord first. Uh, and Mr. Probu is going out here. Now, I'm a little bit curious how Choosy's going to make this wall. Because there is actually a very nice wall you can make. Um, oh, looks like it's going to be an overpool expand. No, it's going to be 12 something. Okay. Never mind, that's just a scouting drone. Is he going to 12 hatch? He's going to get blocked by this probe, so that's not ideal. No, he's actually going to 12 pool. I wonder if he wanted to 12 hatch, but just in response to this probe, he changed it. I don't know though, but that's like the usual scout timing, and this. I don't know how Choosy's going to wall this. See, one, one nice thing about match point is this mineral field. You can actually make a completely tight wall, and then later on just mine out the mineral patch and just walk out the side. For example, you can do a pylon, forge, gateway underneath, um, and then you only have to block, like I think, like one thing, or maybe two. So that's quite nice. Um, but this this wall, like, how's he going to fill this whole gap? He's going to have a gateway. I don't know. That looks quite wide. I'm a little bit nervous for choosing. Meanwhile, he is a... Uh, Blocking this hatch right here, and Juice is actually. Oh no, he did. He, okay, so he went. He's going Forge Nexus, and then uh, and cannons. Looks like we do have six links being produced, and there is the first cannon. So I'm really, really curious. Really curious about what's going on here. Meanwhile, look at look at Juicy actually scouting the inside of his base. He's actually a little bit afraid of a uh, of a proxy hatchery. Huh. Look at that. But, uh, but instead, Pass has just taken the bottom right base as his, uh, as his second base. And it looks like the probe had a duel with the drone there, but the drone does run back to its Ling buddies and will take a third base. So, Pass is actually playing fairly standard. And it's quite interesting that Choosy would scout for that. That is very uncommon. I, I, I think it happened once in a, in a pro game. It was um, Zero versus somebody. Was it versus Hyuk? It might have been Zero versus Hyuk. It was Zero versus somebody where he like proxy hatched on the ZBZ and it was awesome. Meanwhile, Choosy has done a less than ideal wall, so this this configuration looks nice. It's tight between these guys, you know, you kind of nestle the cannon in here. But look at this giant ass space, like what? Like, dude, it's a good thing he's not playing against Michael right now. Hi Michael, I see you there. <laughs> I was, uh, shout out to you. Uh, and not only that, not only is this gap huge, but... I don't know if Dragoons can get out. Actually, maybe Dragoons can walk through here. I think I think Dragoons might be able to walk through there. I'm not really sure. <laughs> anyway. Oh yeah, that's right. Michael actually is playing against Choosy tomorrow in Gosu Cup. Ah, oh, that's that's gonna be fun. Yeah, so just pick match point, and then it's like free win. <laughs> you just you, you know how he walls it now. <laughs> oh Choosy, game game. Can you teach Choosy how to wall this map, please? Oh wait, no, don't teach don't teach Choosy. Oh wait, what am I what am I talking about? Game did like the most abysmal wall we've ever seen yesterday. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Don't don't teach him. Okay, I'm I'm just going completely irrelevant mode now. So what, what what's going on in this game? Okay, probes running away from Zerglings. Um 
two random links here at the bottom right. Layer morphing. Yeah, nothing fancy. So anyway. Uh, Mr. Probe's gonna be able to see everything. And looks like we do have Stargate and Citadel this time. And still no second gas. Is there plus one? There's no plus one though. Okay. Is he gonna get plus one? Is he gonna do the same uh, Corsair Zealot thing? Or not? And there we do have the Spire from past, so no quick Hydra Den from him this time. Uh, is this guy not mining? That guy's actually not mining, I don't know what happened to him. That guy's on strike. Anyway. Oh, looks like we have plus one air weapons this time. And once again, uh, it's a relatively slow gas, but this time not, not, not so much. And once again, once again, for those of you just joining us, I'm going to reiterate, I am a little bit sick, I have a bit of a sore throat, so I'm trying not to talk too loudly, trying to conserve my energy. Because not only do I have to cast Nation Wars today, but there's going to be like an epic cast tomorrow with Gosu Cup, because it's going to be group stages, and I'm just going to have like a million and one best of threes to cast, so hopefully I, uh, I survive that. It's actually, it's actually kind of fortunate that this weekend there's no Pro League, so I'm not overly stretched. Anyways, we do have five hatches from uh, from past. So he's playing this this as standard as can be. Uh, meanwhile, the first Corsair's out, and Choosy actually, look at this, so because Choosy's probe is alive for so long, he doesn't actually need to go over and scat with his Corsair immediately, he can actually just kill his Overlord, uh, which is quite nice. Meanwhile, the other Overlord buddies are in fact running away. And that's a lame, that's not a, that's not a Zergling, but anyway. So actually, you know, with the Simon, with the Simon X here, by the way, this wall's not completely terrible, but it's still, like, moderately terrible. It went from being, like, horrendous to being, you know, to being bad. Yeah, that's what happened. Because now he has, like, he now his core is, like, easily snipeable from anywhere, and he still walled himself in. Although I guess he can still mine this out and walk out that way, so it's not... No, it's, a, it's, a, it's not a good wall for this map. It, it's an okay... See, now the thing is, this wall is okay on some maps. It's just not a, it's just not a match point wall. And it looks like uh, Choosy's gonna get three Overlord kills here, which is quite nice for him. Now he's gonna run away. As eight Scourge are made to deal with the two Corsairs. Although, uh, he's going for plus one Sarah, so Pass will still need those eventually. Anyway, why, why are there a bunch of random links in my, in my chat? Are they porn? If they're not porn, they're no good. We need, we need more porn in the chat. I'm just ki I'm kidding! I'm kidding, do not link porn in the chat, do not do that. So, anyway, uh, looks like we have a manor gas here at the natural, that's a little bit unfortunate. <clears throat> Random juggling at the minor only. And... Three sunkens at this base, is that really necessary? I don't know. I don't know if you actually need that. Actually, yeah. Pass is actually playing a little bit scared now after what happened last game. Oh man. He's getting mind gamed. Seriously, he's like way behind on supply. Oh no, he just made some dudes, but oh, oh, is it gonna be enough? Oh my god, is he just gonna run straight in? Oh my god. The sunken wall is just like, it doesn't even matter. And look, look at all the drones chasing now. Does he, is he really just gonna kill it with all his drones? You, well, that's actually a really nice, really nice drill, excuse me. Oh man, but they're losing so many drones! Oh man, he's losing so many drones! He's gonna kill the zealots, but he just lost half his drones. He's actually just still not mining. He's just using his drones as attacking units. Please mine. Please, oh my god. Oh, pass. Oh, pass. He's making some lurkers of the third, but uh, Choosy's gonna take his mineral only. Okay, so... Oh, it looks like another drone sniped. Seriously though, Pat, I feel so bad. He made like a million sunkins, and they just didn't do anything. This is like, dude, this is this is like the fight. You know, this is like uh, all those people who invested pre-financial crisis, and then there's like you know, every, the economy just completely collapsed, and they lose all their money, and their investments are like completely worthless. It's like exactly what happened to Pass. Except this like wasn't even an economic crisis. He just like let the zealots into his base. 
Anyways. Uh, now he's gonna go counter this third. And... Shuji doesn't have units there. He actually doesn't really have a standing ground army. Because he spent... Oh man, he spent a lot of money on these courses. Is this just off one Stargate? This is off one Stargate. So he's gonna do a lot of damage with this. But... He's gonna... Is he gonna lose his third? He should lose his third. That was a little bit awkward. Oh, storm, 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 storm! Again, again. Are those, is that gonna be enough? Wow, wow. Storm and cannons are pretty good in this game, guys. I don't know if you knew that. Photon cannons are pretty good. And you see, people always laugh at me for making a lot of photon cannons, but did you, did you not just see that? Do you not just see how he just completely owns that attack? And now he's down to 62 of 37 supply. Whereas Choosy's at uh, 116 and taking another base and uh oh, oh no the DTs is no detection ah Doc Tem, Doc Tem look at the drones coming off they're like holy shit Batman, oh shit oh shit Choosy's taking the top left but this is like oh my god he's making a spore it doesn't matter oh dude as if it wasn't enough like so this is like adding insult to injury right here because he already showed that the sunken wall is completely worthless. And now he's just going to kill everything. Pass is making emergency everything in his main base, but... Oh, Choosy. Choosy, that's not very nice, man. Choosy's just, like, picking on the little... Little baby Zergs right now. This is this is just mean. Oh. Oh. Is he going to attack his own Hydroden or something? Yeah, look, he attacked the Larva. Look, he attacked the Hydroden. He's trying to splash the DTs down. It's, but the DTs, like, left already. He just, like, wander into the main and he's still attacking the Hydroden. Lol. So at least there's a spore colony there now, so that's good. But oh, oh, uh, wait, do they do they really three shot lurkers? Oh yeah, DTs DTs with plus one actually three shot lurkers. Wow, man, Protoss is a pretty strong race. I'm not gonna lie, this is like a pretty good race. That's probably like why I got my B minus. It's just like a, I'm I just play a good race. GG from Pass and Choosy taking it with a pretty easy 2-0 here. And uh, giving Poland uh, their first set. Um. All right. So I'm just gonna just gonna wait for more replays. From Monsieur Ewa. Once again, guys, check out altitudegame.com because it's awesome. And I think that's it. And if you see Ewa and Game, tell them they're they're cool because they organize this. And what else? What else? See, I'm I'm just like I'm just like filling time now because I don't have replays. Oh yeah, go to my YouTube channel. YouTube.com slash SailBW because the VODs of this will be there, VODs of Pro League are there. It's just like a lot of stuff. Although it looks weird now because of the new YouTube format, so that's a little bit unfortunate. But otherwise, it's a pretty awesome place. Yeah, we have the replays. Oops. Whoops. Do, 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 do. Man, why does Skype not save the last location you saved files to? It's a little bit silly. All right, load. Is this it? Oh, all right, guys. So the next two players for Poland and Hungary will be none other than Mr. True Touch for Poland and Hungary's ace, the King of Silver. So it's going to be a ZVZ, 
but these guys are both pretty good, so it should be exciting. <clears throat> Alright. Looks like A was actually named all the replays properly now. It's quite good. It's quite good. So, looks like they are starting on ground zero. Ah, that's one more thing to note, is that uh, the new Pro League maps have actually been mixed in to, uh, to, out, uh, to Nation Wars. I believe ground zero and... What's the one that begins with a C? Chain Reaction uh, are in this week's map.